We have had some trouble with mice in our RV, and I think I have discovered where they are gaining access. So right here, I am underneath the bathroom vanity, and this hole where the water lines and the drain are going through, that goes through our bathroom and eventually under our tub, which then goes through a hole in our, our plywood floor and into the underbelly, into the tanks. My belief is that the mice are getting access to the interior of the RV through the hole that they had to cut in the plywood floor for the P-trap. So this uh, opening here, it leads to the kitchen. Um, on this side it goes under the refrigerator and then it goes over to the galley. But in this direction, as I said, it goes in and underneath the tub, so I, I can't access under the tub, so what I'm going to do is seal this hole off with some copper mesh and some spray foam. And, uh, and then I will go and also spray foam and copper mesh the hole that has been cut through the floor f uh, to allow for the P-trap. Okay, so this is the copper mesh that I'm going to use, and only because I had it on hand. You could use steel wool as well, but something metallic the mice don't like to chew through. I just happen to have this on hand. I bought it at Lee Valley. I uh, use it in the garden to keep slugs away from lettuce, that kind of thing. But it will work out well here, and you can see in that hole now that that is actually the access for the mice. I've just kind of packed it in there loosely and in such a way that I can now get the tip of my spray gun, my spray foam gun, in and around the wire mesh. All right, I've got the foam uh, in in place and you can see the copper there so it's it's kind of the the foam is woven through the copper. I actually like the copper mesh because the the mesh is, is large enough that when the foam comes out of the can it can work its way through the copper mesh so once this hardens up I believe that we will no longer have any mice getting into the living space here I will have to still go around and deal with the hole that they cut through the floor for the P-trap, which is where the mice are coming in to begin with. Okay, I'm in the rear compartment under the bunks, and you can see this is my tub. This is the P-trap, and this is the area that they had to cut through the floor, the plywood floor, in order for the P-trap to have access underneath the tub. So I believe this is where the mice have been gaining access through the insulated underbelly of our RV. So I took some more of that copper, I laid it out in here, and then of course took the spray foam and, and sprayed it in all through the copper. Now my understanding is that mice and chipmunks, they won't, they won't, they will chew, they will chew through the spray foam, but they won't chew through it if, if it has uh, the steel wool or the copper mesh in it, uh, they just don't like chewing through that stuff so they'll go and find easier access. So I believe that uh, with this sealed and the other areas underneath the vanity and in around the kitchen there I believe that I have uh, at least slowed them down so I will uh, post a video later on after some time has passed and I'll, and I'll, and I'll update you as to, as to whether or not I've solved that problem.